don't know why people use it all the time. People are like, oh, you're not a girl, like, though. Piss off. Because you know what? You guys say, oh, you guys wear makeup, you say, hey, it's because we're insecure. We want to do what we want to do to make our ourselves feel good. But you know what? You're also the same girls to put a whole a whole lot of clown shit on your face. <laughs> but then also say, I want to date a real man. <laughs> Oof! I Is that true, though? Ahead, Is that true, though? <laughs> Yeah, this is what I'm like. Yeah, turn it down a bit, but yeah, this is the non copyright. Yeah. Non copyright, yeah, sound. Right, let's do it. Wait, am I on? This is uh, fucking thing, innit? Yeah, it is a bit loud. We've got yeah. music. What's up, bros? Welcome back to another video today. We are in a podcast. We are a new person. It's Charlie. So, Charlie's going to introduce himself. How are you doing? All right, pretty good today. Yeah. Good. Yeah, we've been wanting to do this podcast for a while. It's a Thursday. I'm sorry if you can hear the lawnmower in the background. But you might hear some music in the background, but that's just, you know, it's just, it's a nice Thursday. We've got everything set yeah, up. Try that. Um, a lot of things has happened since the last video we've done. So I have my appendix stuck out. Yes, you did. What do you guys think about that? Like? Well, you was going to be dead. Yeah, same. <laughs> <laughs> you thought I was going to be dead? No, it's just when they said about the whole burst thingy. It did yeah. shit me up. So for context, guys, um, I had my appendix removed two weeks ago, almost three weeks ago. Um, so it's pretty much that, really. I remember I had my appendix took out. It was it was, it, it was the first time going to sleep in the hospital yeah. alone. My first time sleeping like with a needle. And mm. That shit was crazy. Like, have you guys ever been? Have you been in operation before? Or something? No. Not really. No. <laughs> not yet for me. Yes. Not yet. Not yet. So you guys, it's the first day. A lot of things has happened. So how are you guys yeah, all doing? Um, a lot of things. Pretty good today. Yeah. yeah. It's been alright. Okay, it's, yeah. it's been alright. Um, England football is doing alright. Yeah, I mean, decent for decent, now. Decent. Decent. We actually watched it. Um, what day was it? Tuesday. Tuesday. Yeah. We watched it on a Tuesday. It was Germany versus England. And um, it wasn't too bad. Eng England was still a bit yeah. shit. But it is what it is, and um, yeah, <laughs> it is what it is. I can't believe we, we just ruined that one. But um, so. it's all. Right. We want to talk about something, like anything. Go ahead, anything. Uh. anything. We always this talk. Is, is we talk thing. a lot, but when it comes to podcasts, we, our brain <laughs> <laughs> goes away. We don't know what to talk about. Anything. Can you start with any uh. topic. Say any topic. Um. We got a podcast, we don't know what we're talking about. Okay, do you Six. know what I want to talk about? Go ahead. Okay, let me, let me finish this. Can you can say something wrong? So, people, I was laid, not kidding, not yet. But what has happened? Talk about you, Jim. What has happened since the last video? Last video. Um, yeah, was that, that was a, party? a vlog, that was a party. Yeah. Party vlog. Oh. Which one? The one where I got upset or the one. No. Was it about Ndechi? Dirty, yes, that was the last one. Yeah. Um, Oh, Austin. Football. Was it? I got no clue. The last video reaction was Boxing. football. Boxing. 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 It was dead sea lost again. Ridiculous. So yes, sorry that we haven't been uploading. I don't, we have literally been grinding. We've been we? grinding on the set. So, you know, like, look at this. This is our first time recording the set. Yeah, I actually forgot to Ma say Man's that. Cave. Um, Man Cave. Clubhouse. We had so many parties. If you guys check my Instagram, it's Adam Morris. We've had so many parties in here with Charlie, with everybody. It's been so fun. I'm so glad we have this. It's yeah. like a nice relaxing area just to talk and we had to do a podcast in here. It was a free day, so we just decided to do one and um yeah, I know you can't really see a lot but put the um, um if we get the LED lights on where was it? The, the, hey, uh, okay. you guys talking about some Um you know, me and Charlie actually tried getting a job, you know we hey, We all did. Try to get a done our C V done, haven't we? But the yeah. fucking yeah and yeah, we're be I really do hope I get a job because I can work on the set. Yeah. And um What would where was it? Okay, so let's say you have the money. What would you spend on? Go ahead, your first conversation. We'll talk about money. Yeah, hold it, hold it. Sir. Talk, talk about money, both of you guys. What would you guys spend it on? I'd save all my money and spend it on myself when I need it. Yeah. Yeah. Fair enough. Um, mine is like for said and like more clothes, really. And like to like give some money out to people who have helped me a lot. So, yeah. you know, that's what we do. And like that someone. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> <Also, a> reference. <laughs> <laughs> we ordered a new reference. Reference. But, um, yeah, it's, it's gonna be the first time getting a job. We've all applied for. Um, you applied for. Yo, I can't believe the confidence you did to go in there. So, what did you ask? So, we went in Doncaster Centre, you went in a coffee shop. What did you say then when you applied for it? Well, 
Uh, have you got any job vacancies? Yeah. I've done all this sort of stuff before in, coffee, in a coffee shop and that. That's yeah, true. You actually have. Yeah. Yeah. College, yeah. I mean, yeah. what college. does it say? Uh, yeah, just send your CV towards them. We'll get back to you. Uh, where, how long did it take? A day to get back. Wow. That's some crazy shit. Like, it's our first time actually applying for jobs, and I think that's, that's amazing, to be fair. Mm. There were some things I do want to talk about. At mm. least I, I sent it to you or something on your phone. I kind of forgot. What was it? It was, um... Oh, God. Yeah, I, got, I, I do want to talk about some things. I, I, I did have my appendix took out, and it was crazy. It was my first time, and it was actually... I've never had an operation before. And there was two lovely nurses who was um, caring for me. I was in there for two days. Um, yeah, it was it was mad. I, I can't really express yeah, yeah, yeah. how mad it was. It was actually, you know, and I, I've still got my stitches in. I don't know if you guys can see from this angle, but um, yeah, yeah. That. So what, what, it, what happened since then? Like since the last party? Well, um, we've just been drinking. We've been. To be fair, we've been chilling, really. College work is wank. college work. We've been, you know, college work is wank. wank yeah, wank. college is so wank. Like, I don't, I don't like college. I think it's, it's not the best. I, it's overrated, but it's not bad. It's better than my last school. But um, yeah, is there anything up there? If you scroll up, oh yeah, wait. There we go. So there's some things I want to talk about. There is fake friends I want to talk about. Fortnite. I think I want to, I want to talk about that. Charging up vapes. Snapchat and makeup. So we talk about makeup first. Makeup. Because you know what? Because you, know you know what makeup is. It's um, we don't give a fuck if we get cancelled because we've literally our whole um, what's call it? Our audience is like we don't even have a lot of audience. So yeah. fuck it, you know. Makeup. You don't want to talk about makeup. But this is what I think about makeup. I think a little bit of makeup now and then is not too bad for girls, right? Because we all know makeup. Girls have makeup more than boys. That's a fact. Okay. Yeah. Um, makeup isn't too bad. If you put a bit on, but the thing is, I I only like makeup when they know how to put it on properly. You see the girls who looks like they've put on a f a, a different mask. Yeah. Right. Yeah. You yeah. literally, it is absolutely mad. It's how mad. Like, remember that person? Oh, can I say the name? But it was in the own. Yeah. We saw her right twice. It was on Facebook or something. She looked without her makeup. She looked like she, she was looked, five. She looked better. I'm yeah, God. she looked better. You, you, okay, that was bad timing. She looked five and I said she looked better. Okay, okay. Oh, for, for. No, I mean, she looked younger, but then I saw her with makeup on, on Facebook, and I thought it was her older sister. Yeah. Because makeup literally changes your face. And I don't know why people use it all the time. People are like, oh, you're not a girl, like, though. Piss off. Because you know what? You guys say, oh... You guys wear makeup, you say, hey, we're supposed to be insecure. We want to do what we want to do to make our, ourselves feel good. But you know what? You're also the same girls to put a whole a whole lot of clown shit on your face. <laughs> but then also say, I want to date a real man. <laughs> Oof! Uh, is that true though? Is that in. true though? They put all the fake bullshit. Hey man, if we get cancelled, he's no, getting cancelled. Not me. I'm they blow saying. up their lips. They literally, <laughs> literally change their face. Fake nails, fake everything, fake tan and everything. A bit of it is fake heart. Fake of it. Okay, a bit of it isn't too bad, but a whole load of it. But then to have the right to say I want to date a real man is bollocks. Yeah, it's like yeah. it goes both ways, and yeah. that's why I don't like about makeup. It's like it's not you. You know what I'm saying? It's not. Like, you, you know, at the end of the day, you might go to a club with a whole makeup on, but we all know next morning when you wake up, you're gonna look like wank. So shut up. Like I saw this girl who all yeah, of makeup, and I'm like, I prefer you without makeup. I think you look prettier. And uh, it's, it's more natural. Yeah. It's more natural. What do you think? People with makeup should not wear it all the time. Yes, yeah. because yeah, you're wasting money, don't you think? It's wasting a lot of money on stuff all the time if they need it. Yeah. Yes. That's, that's, that's true. true. Yeah. I guess what? It's the thing is what pisses me off. It's <laughs> fake. For girls, what is it? <laughs> <laughs> no, don't. Just <laughs> 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 speak. Get your fair side, girls. I'm gonna talk about another problem. But the thing is, it's, I, 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 it's the fact that it's not them. Yeah. It's not yeah. who who they are. Like I say, a bit of makeup on, and if they can do it right, it's nice. Yeah, but I've a whole lot of makeup with fake tan and fake nails, and fake, fake everything, but then they want to date a real man. Now, where's the double standards? It's like yeah. you're, you're putting some fake shit on, so yeah. how is that going to work if you want to date a real man? Yeah. It makes yeah. no sense. Exact like same. Like, um, people who doesn't know how to use makeup. Oh, people <laughs> who doesn't know how to I've seen the girls. They look like they've just a clown has painted on their face. Yeah, yeah. Here, let me put some red on, red on you. They look like wank. 
that's our man about. That's just shit. At least we're trying. But don't you think we're trying to look good? The thing is, boys, try, boys try to look good from them. We try to um, sew our hairs out, get scissors, you, you know. We try to make ourselves look good but we, by having clothes on and that. And, you know, the things which is in you. But girls just decide just to... Instead of, like, it's like a fat girl. It's like, they try, I don't like how fat girls can put makeup on. <laughs> oh god here we go it's like you're fat so it's like <laughs> how are you going to try to make yourself look good by your face lose some weight by 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 faking your face because you know it's the easiest thing to do but you know the e the but the realest thing to do is actually lose the weight so how can a fat you know why he's acting like this guys no he, no he saw andrew tate and he's I like know, i want to be like i him. saw his attitude i want to say what i, I want to say i saw his attitude and i saw that but he did you not know, held back but you know what after this podcast besides everyone agreeing with you everyone just you got a bunch of text messages Messing just on Instagram saying fuck you, fuck you, nah, I can I can you speak. discriminate women. No, 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 no. And I, I'm out of it. Like I say, like I don't mind it. It's just I'm all about makeup. It's like girls try to get away with, like they don't exercise. <laughs> <laughs> no, I've, I've I know some women who yeah, goes exactly. to the gym and I instantly yes, respect exactly. that. Exactly, because you know what? They don't rely on makeup they to look good. They don't rely on them. Um, like material, like material stuff. You know, they good. try to actually on my body inside them. Yeah, know. they mentally try to make themselves look good mentally and physically. But girls, you are cowards. Will only put fake shit on to make themselves look good. <laughs> and I think it's the podcast by us. I, 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 I think I think it's not right. I think makeup is not bad, but you only use it with a good timing, the what the right way, and you have to use it as a way to. Make yourself look good to a limit. Like, because you can't be fat as fuck, then put makeup on, then expect people to be like, you look gorgeous, even though you weigh 20 stone. <laughs> oh with, my with god. Fake material things you've done. Doing this, doing this is easier than getting some effort in and losing the weight. Fucking hell. Um, That's why I think. I'm not discriminate. I, I'm on about makeup. I'm not on about girls, I'm on about makeup. Yeah. I don't like um, my personal. Because I've seen my past girlfriends, like, um, they look great pretty when they don't have no makeup. But they have makeup on, yeah. They look obviously more pretty or like just pretty, yeah. But I prefer them without makeup. Yeah, I don't know if that's just I me. Agree. Like, or like any girl I see anyway. And I was like, yeah, I prefer you without makeup, really. You know, like, just don't overdo it, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> I want to see so much in this podcast. I want to see me talking about fat women. And like, You're fucked, Dad. We're getting cancelled, man. Yeah, this, yeah. this is our first ever last podcast on this set. I'm it's telling like, you. What do you think about makeup? People wa- that wear makeup should not wear it all the time because yeah. it makes them look stupid and <laughs> idiot, like fucking idiots. Fucking <laughs> 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 okay, no. As it's true, no. Wait, like I say, people who's fat as fuck, they don't bother trying to lose their weight. <laughs> they don't bother <laughs> trying to. Bother they don't bother trying to. Lo- they don't bother <laughs> losing the weight themselves. They don't bother putting the effort into change themselves. Yeah. They just know the easiest option is to be fat as fuck, then put makeup on yeah. just to look good. That's cheating. Yeah. That's cheating, right? <laughs> kind of. It's, but it's like it's, a, it's, it's, a, like it's what they want to do. It's, it's a shortcut, but it depends if they really care. If they don't care, if they're like, I put makeup, I don't care. But if they care about their weight, but they put makeup, I'm not losing the weight. I'm like, it's well, like you nah, lose weight. Because you know the easiest option is to. If, I don't want to date a girl who knows the easiest option is to pick, pick, pick fake shit. At least she has the money to get it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Put pick. You know, pick. I can't speak now. Put fake shit. If they know it's easiest to put fake shit on, they're actually trying to lose weight and hard work and effort I'm not having that but is that the same for guys though because obviously we don't put makeup on no guys. we don't we don't need the um, thing is what what men, do we do as fake as what as we guys? do dude we look jawline we have not gonna lie women's hair I don't that's hair that's different that's different no, that's fine I don't mind that but like we if we try to look good we'll put some good keens on put good clothes on fucking sort our face out fucking sort our, our haircut yeah. you know what I'm saying we put some good we don't put fake shit on the real layer of what this is, skin. Yeah. Skin is a real like, thing, like, not fake shit. Like Violet said to me, like James, you use drugs for your skin and all that. You put, I'm like no, I don't put tan on. I just put products for my to spots. make your skin look better. To to no, it's literally to heal your skin, yeah, yeah. not to hide it. Yeah, that is to use. That is used to heal your skin, not to put fake shit on to cover that fake skin you're using that to heal your skin that's the difference i'm putting makeup on makeup on is just to cover all that bullshit you have yeah. now there's a difference if someone is insecure about their acne that's okay for me i think that's fine if you have acne and you know some people really have it bad 
with acne. We've seen some girls, you must have seen girls with really bad acne. Yeah. And I know like Toph, in, I'm a celebrity, she puts makeup on, mm. right? Throughout celebrity, right? She's the only person who put makeup on because she had really bad acne. You know what? And that's fine. Mm. Yeah. Because that's, in, that's like, you know what I'm saying? That's something mm. else compared to what we were talking yeah. about. Yeah, anyway. Um, so that's what I want to Moving chip jacks, like. That was just fucking crazy. That's what I think about it. We already cancelled. For women are hating us, wonder why I can't get a girlfriend, Adam. So thank you for that. Sorry. Um, what was that? Oh, yeah. I want to talk about... One thing I want to actually talk about, besides that list real quick, is fake friends, you know. We've experienced so many times that fake friends, like, fucked us over. I can name two of them, but I'm not going to name them. You're fucking lucky, you know. Um, I, I could rant. I could say something right now. But if it's up to no, you, No, not rant, but I can say their mentality is. You know what their mentality is? Go ahead, man. Them, when you're with friends, in a group of friends, you're supposed to say things to each other which you need to hear. Yeah. You're supposed to say things with, hey mate, you're going a bit wrong on this, I don't really appreciate that. That's, you, you, that's why Violin and I, we're good friends, because we tell each other what we need to hear, and we both, we all level up. We learn together. We level up, we learn, we grow, we adapt. That's called friends. We tell each other what we're both doing, what we're all doing wrong, then we just, we, we level up. We literally level up. But there's some mentality people who don't listen to people. Yeah. When someone says, oh, you're going a bit wrong on that, they're like, nah, fuck you, I don't know. You know what I'm saying? I they don't it. understand the fact yeah. that you do need to listen to people. So, yeah, what do you think about it? Well, friends should be there for each other, support each other, and love each other. Yeah. True. true. Said it. That's said it how it is. Said it how it is. Besides fucking off and using their money. I mean, once. Like, but fuck's sake, the person who fucked off last time gave him himself a birthday. They they passed our birthdays. But then came back, used our shit. Ex- we expected for them to give us something back. Instead, fucked off when we told them about it. Like, like I say, they friends supposed to listen to each other. You, it's like a grinding thing. You grind on each other to kind of understand where they're going wrong, so they can be the best person. As you can, yeah, and that's absolutely. what friends are. It's not the c- count of like we're all friends because we all know how to agree on each other. Yeah, that's fake friends to be fair. Real friends tell each other yeah. what we both. That's why we're better. so close to Charlie. Right? That's why we all close as a friendship to everybody because we we are real. But that's why I think anyway. I, I, yeah, yeah. But yeah, that's why I think anyway. I I. I I just think it's it's complete bullshit. It is bullshit. Com- and for them to fuck off, because they know it's the easiest option. They know, I'm not going to take no responsibility. I know how to run away from things, because I cannot listen and adapt into what people are saying to me. Because I have my mentality of arrogance to not listen to no one, and then I'm going to grow up with no fucking friends. Yeah, and these two people are meant to be going to the Marines. Right, fuck off, fam. No responsibility. You don't listen, you don't have respect. You have, don't have no respect, you can't take responsibility, and you run away from your problems. Fucking How is that going to work out in the military? It's fair loss though, isn't it? Fair loss. Right. Right. So that's Sorry. my man over. I'm not going to say their names. I have that respect that I'm not going to get yeah, everybody yeah, yeah. to nail into them. That's unfair. It is. But, yeah. But you got to just watch out for people like them where they just use it's you and the then The main fuck off. thing which pisses me off is that they don't listen. Yeah. They don't, they don't have the mentality of being aware of everybody else. Mm. They don't listen to people. And because you don't listen, there's a chain of reaction which causes after they don't listen to the people, they don't adapt, it's just repeat, it's bullshit. Absolutely. <laughs> Is there any more topics? There should be a couple more. But, but that's why I think. That's, yeah. So we got, um, oh yeah. What do you guys think about Snapchat? Snapchat. Um, I know they do these things where they're on Snapchat and they're like, send an X if you really my best mate. Bro, I, I know you. You know I'm a US. I'm not going to send an X to show you or prove to you. You know I am. Fuck off. Yes. Simple as that. Stop, I, I don't like when we do Look, that. It's like, you know Snapchat I am. is not bad. However, when I see on stories like that you said, like, oh, put an X if you are my best friend, or if you skip this story, that means you are fake. It's all complete attention seeking. If Especially when they say put an X to say that you're my best friend, then they see on the story, highly expected. At blah blah, thank you for like, being yeah. next. Yeah, it's like, bro, it's like, like if you care about that more than actually not knowing the fact that in person, it, it, it's like, yeah, you know, my best mate, I'm not gonna say it, but you know it. Like, it's like Riley saying, send an X to do 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 do. But I didn't send an X, but I'm like, bro, you know I'm my best mate. I just don't want to put an X. You're not going to waste your time. You're not going to put your energy into something bullshit like that. Yeah, so. It's sire, it's attention sinking. And you're fuck all to do when you do like that. Yeah. So that's yeah. what I think about Snapchat. I think it's not bad, but when people put on their stories, put an X if, if, you're, if you're my best mate. I'm not going to do it's, it. It's, like, it's a simple case of like, no, we know we're best mates. We see it in person. I don't need to put a, a letter 
to prove that you are I am not a fake. Yeah. I'm not gonna put a letter. Like, it might not be that deep, but it's, it's a not bit, deep, it's but a bit it's also like silly, I see on the it? stories, I'm like, why the fuck are you doing it's that? It's a bit silly, innit? It's a bit stupid. It's a bit stupid anyway. Hey, so, I'm sorry, you want to talk about anything? Any topics? Go ahead. Go ahead. Anything we've been talking about recently? You know? What we've been getting into a skin? We'll go for charging, charging all night. Oh, oh, yeah. Like, yeah, um, we don't say anything else. Um, like I said, I, I, we do fape, but like, we do it mainly like times right now, or at parties. Like, I've stopped, I've, we all slowed down a bit, you know. Um, but I got this one guy who was with me, and he was like, uh. Hey, I got I got finish sizing my vape now. And I was like, what the fuck are you doing? You meant be you meant be going to my weens and you're doing something like that. I was like, and then I know I do it. I don't get me wrong, but I do it rarely yeah. or like times like now. But I don't charge one up because I'm that sad. You get what I'm saying? It, wait, wait. It's a bit. It is sad. I saw I got a mate. He used to be in my vape. He literally was like, "Do you have a PS4 charger to charge oh, up yeah, my vape?" And I'm like, are you for fucking real? Yeah, yeah. You are plugging in to. Is that with the society now? Ten years ago, it used to be, oh, do you have a charger for my controller? No, sort of so, so we can play Minecraft. Now it's, do you have a charger to plug in my fape? Do you know how sad that is? It's a bit. It I, is like, I, I don't know get we, it. we look like hypocrites, so I mean, jump it up soon. But it's only, like, right now, parties or something. Like, but it's like, charge one up. Look, like, I don't like, have, a big look, one. I don't mind chargeable face, but it's it's not the... It's a bit kiddie, isn't it? It's like a kid thing, you know, charging up and... Like, come on. It's like... We're gonna do it, get a proper fucking fag, at least. Yeah. Know? Yeah, I don't... I don't that's a buffet. Like, that guy, I can't say his name, but like, on the bus, oh, no. he had a big one, 70 quid. No right? nicotine, my boy. No nicotine, so I don't get the fucking point of that. Put in his pocket, it was burnt. And that was like a week after he bought it. You know why? He's a coward, he doesn't know how to use it, and he, he's he's acting like he's a man, but he's wasting his money on shit which has been burnt. Yeah. It is ridiculous. It's like, be a man, and stop being a... Pussy. It was, it's just one of those things like yeah, yeah. you're charging up your faves and you're burning your seventy pound fave in your pocket because you don't know what the fuck you're doing. Yeah. It's like you're just trying to be a man, but you, you're not. Yeah. You're not being a man. You're just trying to act like a man until you burn. Because I think he's trying to copy him um, on Valve, mate, didn't he? Yeah, yeah, but at least he knows how to fuck it. Yeah, Yo, exactly, I can yeah. say his name. Can we say his name? Sander. Yeah, we can say Sander. Like, Sander. Sander knows how to fucking use his faves. Like he's not a fucking idiot. I mean, <laughs> 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 for the guy, just. Was like a baby who was trying to follow him, but then just failed. It was like, oh, for fuck's sake, just stop. Oh. But one thing with me, like, they're meant to be going to my weeds, but they're faping and drinking. I get it. I'm faping a bit right now, a bit. But, but we're not like. I know what I'm doing. And I go to the gym. I think of what I'm, I keep myself sustained. Is that non copyright, right? Yeah. <laughs> Very okay. So. Uh, but yeah, you know. That's why I think, you know. I know it looks like I'm a hypocrite, but go ahead. <laughs> but, um. I don't know if I want to talk about. Fortnite. Now let um, me tell you something about Fortnite. I actually got an idea for Fortnite. Let me tell you something. Minecraft is one thousand percent better. Let me, let before me we subject, we were talking about the fake, right? Yeah. Before we another thing about fakes, when people actually don't take it in. I know it's not deep and people are like, oh it's healthy though if you don't take it in. It's like I get it for the flavour, but I, you're just wasting it. If you want it for the flavour, get a watermelon yourself. Drink, oh, get yeah. a watermelon drink or something. If you, if you just want the, if you want like the flavour, do it. You have to go all the way in or not at all. Yes. You look like a fucking coward. That's what that guy did. But sometimes if you do take it in for some time, like you some Charlie. Yeah. That's alright, but people when people just, do it all the time, it's like, like, we, so, we know those two people. Yeah. You know, mm-hmm. Can't say they literally got nicotine. They literally got two pencil vapes mm. with no nicotine in. So it's just smoke. And it's like, what is... It's like they're trying to look good, but it's like... They're trying to adapt into what the society and their friends are doing, but, doing but they don't right. do it right. It's like, if you're not going to do it, don't bother at all. It's simple. It's like, what? it's a waste of time. So when a guy got 70 pound fape, 70 pound fape, no with nicotine. no nicotine in, it's like, you are an idiot. I you are wasting yeah. your money. And then burning it on top of that. I, then getting your chargeable <laughs> fape. Fucking hell, isn't it? It's a bit weird. <laughs> but like I said, these two mates, I don't give a fuck if I say shit, okay? They fucked me up. They don't, They always like 100 quid, right? Pretty much, yeah. Pretty much, yeah. And they always like, they always a lot, especially the other one. So at this point, I don't give a fuck. Another thing I want to talk about with these mates is that they have so much yes men around them. Like, I want to talk about yes men. Yes men is like the worst because like, they won't tell you what you need to hear. Like this one, this one guy I've been arguing with, one of my mates, obviously he's fucked off now. Not one single person went up to him and been like, wait a minute, mate, if you did do that, wouldn't you have any mad? Let's try and make it right. 
Not about bollocks. She's no, like, bollocks. I get my dad on your dad. I did it. I tried this shit like that. It's like, bro, someone needs to tell you how it is. She's like, when they do it with us. Because that's what good mates are for, you know? Yeah. But instead, when people can't take criticism or like, good responsibility, they fuck off. And that's what they did. They probably watching this right now, so fuck you. I, they fucked us over. I can't say that. <laughs> yeah, they fucked me over. And they, I've, I've been saved by two, mate, two fake so. friends, don't get me wrong. But they did do, fuck us over back in time, yeah? So at this point, I don't care. Like, Tim was I, I do not cut people off. But when I do, it's for a good fucking reason. They don't take responsibility. They run away. Yeah. Oh, they run away, in a way. Oh, yeah. Wait, one second. Talking about faith, but yeah, you faith. Right well, then, so Fortnite. Let me tell you about Fortnite. I don't think no one. I don't think I'm going to speak about Fortnite like everybody else has. Minecraft is 1000% better. Yeah, yeah. Let me tell you the reason. I got to respect Fortnite how they did it. They tricked millions of children. You know what, right? I know, yeah. They tricked yeah, right. millions of children. Okay? And let me tell you why. Fortnite, it's free, right? Yeah. It's a free game. You guys, they trick you fucking kiddies to play on it. It's for free. They play on it. They play on it. Then there's more things to buy on it. So much shit to buy on it. And it's like, it's a trick, which I kind of respect, but I also don't, because they tricked a thousand kiddies. Like, millions of kiddies. Because they, they say it's for free, but then you have to... After pay so, for so much shit. After so long in, in Fortnite, you've got to start paying for stuff. Yeah, you got to. Minecraft on the other end, you buy it, you pay it. Play buy it. it. That's it. Okay, fine. You might be you might need to pay for some maps but and skins. But that's what you don't the season for Fortnite. You ha, you kind of have to play that to kind of <laughs> progre progress yeah, and stick up yeah. with people. Stay updated. Minecraft on the other hand, look at the Minecraft updates. You Mason don't have updates. to pay for it. You don't need to pay for it. They, they, you just buy for the, the game, then you can literally be on the same update as someone else ten years ago than someone right now. Yeah. Fortnite, I pay, I get Fortnite for free. For free, yeah. And let's try to that down just a bit. I get Fortnite for free. I hear later I've been spending a grand on it. Yeah. It's like they trick kiddies to try to pay for it. Don't get me wrong, they might have to make some money from it because yes, it's free. But the way they do it, but the, the way that you have to pay to progress through the seasons. It's like, hey, you're kind of tricking a whole lot of people here. Like, you're literally Absolutely. tricking kiddies, man. And, like, Minecraft, that's why I respect Minecraft more. Yeah. Because you don't, they don't fucking fall in your face of, get this much money, get, what is it, fee books, fee books. to do this, get the seasons, get this, get that. It's yeah. ridiculous. Like I said, it's a kid's game, you can try it all you want, but I do think it's a bit. I, I, I respect Minecraft I more. Don't I really do. Because yeah. Minecraft, they don't throw it in your face to pay for all of this shit. Yeah. Fortnite does. Anyway, um, I think we should start talking about real life problems right now. Besides Minecraft and Fortnite. But yeah, that's what I think about like, Fortnite. Like um, Ukraine versus Russia right now. Apparently Russia is going ahead with Ukraine and Ukraine's losing right now. Bit right. shit, but um, we, we can't really do anything. But I hope Ukraine wins, but i got no clue what's happening. Like I say, even we might be complaining about these little things right now. And we've got to stay grateful. We're in a we in here, eating alive, you know. Lots of the people is at war, you know. Yeah, so. so let's just realise that. And, um, yeah. What is that, I think? Yeah, what do you think? We should all just stick together with stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. About right. stuff. It's true. It's true, simple as that. Um, yeah, that's why always stay grateful and, like, don't take the things you have for granted. Simple as that, because if you do... Fuck me. Like I say, I said this in the last part. If we had planets around us, it will be planet versus planet. I said this ages ago. Yeah. It would yeah. be planet. If we had livable planets around us, close that? to us, yeah, I said this like ages, yeah. I said it only two times. Yeah. Well. It'll be planet versus planet, right? Yeah. Because yeah. we have no, we're isolated, yeah? We have to argue with each other. Yeah. We have to argue with each other. We have to fight and win wars to win money and it's like a class of clan game like i say if there was planets around us which was livable with other people on it it'll be planet versus planet because we were so bored we have no we have we're isolated and that's why i think i think if we had more planets and um, we would be it'll be planet versus planet and none of this does not matter because the fact is if there was another planet we'd be arguing with them I, so reason, all these yeah. problems on earth it's like you can say all of that, but you know, if there was a pla if there was a bunch of planets around us, we'd all be in one team. Absolutely. So that's why I think I, I don't I don't. It's it's ridiculous. I don't think anyone has ever spoken about that like the way I did right then. Yeah. But that's why I did. So.
Zijn hem al aan de ding. Um. I want to have a thing about something. But you guys, on the happy side of things, I know I've been ranting, I don't want to keep ranting on podcasts, but um. Yeah, like we've just been sulling. We haven't really. Yeah, I can, I, we're looking for a job now, so once we we can upgrade the set, we can upgrade us and whatever. And um. You know, get some fucking money around us. Get some money around us, and uh, I, I've been. Oh god. I've been doing. Uh, is that working, sir? I turned off by accident. Yeah. Is it hello? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So I've been. We've been doing this YouTube channel when we was like 14, 15. And. I, I'm so surprised that we're still here doing it. Yeah. Compared to us, compared it to five years ago. Yeah. Fucking hell. Yeah, oh, it's all, it's all as a YouTube channel. I want to try it out. What is it? Charlie Pittman and Friends 2021. Don't ask why. <laughs> Check that out, guys. But um, yeah. So that's what I think. Um, make. I think the most biggest conversation we're talking about was makeup. Yeah. I think. I think I went in a bit too much, but it's true though. I. I don't. You know what I'm saying? What other problems are there in the world, or what is there in the world? We can talk about. What other things are there in the world? Think of anything. It could be anything. It honestly, anyone could just suggest anything. Do you want to talk about football? Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, um, I don't know what to say. Um, <laughs> it's coming on, Blue. <laughs> I can yeah, it. Nah, Saturday, England versus Italy. I, I honestly can't wait. I really do hope England wins. Yeah, same. We did bit some... of shit with Hungary. Mm. Germany won one. Italy, now let's, let's get a win, you know. Um, we have a good England squad. It's just. Sometimes we need just to. Just nobody knows that's fine. <laughs> yeah, um. So yeah, I hope I hope so. That's something to look forward to, you know. Do you want to talk about drinking and vaping now? So, my honest opinion with drinking. Like, drinking is alright. People say you drink, you fucking idiot. Or like, I don't think that's true. You can sometimes drink for a fun time, like yes. I do. People who said, like Andrew Tate said, you cannot say drinking isn't fun. Yeah. It is fun. <laughs> you cannot say, oh, I don't need to drink because... I can have fun without drinking. You can, but we all know drinking is fun. Yeah. It is fucking fun. And that is the realistic truth. Yeah. Drinking, getting a bit drunk, having a party, it is fun. And you know what it is? One of these things which I realised. You know when we used to all do things? You know when we used to go to the farm and all that? We used to go to these places as a group. Shit gets boring, doesn't it? Yeah. No. Parties, drinking doesn't. Because Drinking's that feeling, more fun and having a good time. Yeah, that yeah. feeling of... That thing in your body to drink and have a good time will never go away. Maybe in decades, decades. But what I saw about parties, parties and drinking is the most consistent fun thing. With the Let's talk about relationships. But, but your face. Yeah, no. It's on what? It's so warm. <laughs> um, relationships. Relationships. Guys, just give your fingers turned off. Yeah. We talked about that. Um, you and Abby, you doing alright? Good. Three years, fucking hell. Yeah. I can't even last for two months. No, <laughs> never can I, to be honest. Well, people leaving me. <laughs> I'm kidding now. Um, no, like I said, relations, it's it's weird because sometimes you can have long term ones. Sometimes you just do it for a laugh, for like a few months or something. Sometimes you do it but for a couple of days. One thing I do want to talk about is that you got to be careful of what you say. Yeah. you got to be careful of what you say. If you're in a relationship and you're doing it for fun, and you know that, but you haven't told your partner of that. And he's saying some bullshit, I love you, I won't leave you, all that bollocks. And two months to leave him, I've been moaning that he's been a bit upset, like, no shit, you said something which made him think you're going to do something more with him. If you're doing you it were, for fun... You weren't on the same page. Yeah, like, you, you want a communication is key. If you want a fun relationship, relationship, tell them that. That's nothing serious, tell them that. If you want to just, if instead, if you're going to just keep saying shit, and then... They leave, and it's gonna make you upset because like they said stuff, but what you meant is you actually meant it. They said something and left, and it's a case of like, like we're too young for it. Yeah, like if yeah, you want a serious relationship, we're all too young for relationships. Like, like, for Just serious that relationships. Like that, yeah. yeah, all I say is that be careful what I, you I say. I still don't take me and Abby's relationship serious. You know? Yeah, yeah. I still don't take it serious. Yeah, yeah. And people are like, why? And it's like you're so I won't like. Yeah, I'm still young. So. It's literally like one of the things where it's like, I'm a laid back guy. I, I don't, I don't need to. Yeah. Be that, be on that page of constantly yeah. worrying, constantly having anxiety about it. Because it's like, yo, you're driving, you're driving yourself in crazy. Yeah, yeah. I you used to. You sit back, yeah. relax, and do whatever happens, happens. And I think that's what we talk about, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because um, you try to use to control everything, you can't control what happens. Yeah, like I Sometimes used to. I talk yeah. about it, I was like, 
No, uh, you. There are some things which you won't be able to control. Yeah. Oh, and so when you try to that. control everything which happens in your life, not in that other way, but I mean like you. You get too stressed. You don't want to get too stressed. Like so, when you control things and when it goes wrong, you get stressed and and it's like you're just driving yourself crazy. But if you just say fuck it. I wish I wish I did respond a bit better yeah. after my last relationship. Like. I don't know what it was. It was just something where I, I didn't. I wish someone came up to me, but it's out of your control. It's, it is what it is. And at first, I took it better on the chin, but I do regret the way I handled it. But now I'm, better and it's all good. Yeah. So simple so, as that. Simple as that. You just don't say shit which you don't mean, yeah. unless because it can really upset the other person. Yeah. I'm not aiming at anyone, of of course, but it's just relationship wise. Tell them if you want to have a fun relationship, not serious. Tell them that. Yeah. If you're gonna say you just bollocks, that you're gonna last forever, but you never did. I gave him I have lost feelings, but it's still gonna hurt if we think yeah, more just, before just I be say something. Saturday, it. man, what you say? Yeah, you know what I'm saying. And um, Saturday then. Mm -hmm. Saturday. Mm -hmm. What predictions on Italy? Oh. What do you think? Uh, two now. Two now. Two, two one. Two England. Oh, yeah. England. Two one. Two England. I'm gonna say it's gonna be. I, I'm gonna say two one to either Germany to Italy or two one to England. They both gonna score, I think. They're both gonna not Germany, Italy. Italy. They're both gonna score, I think. I don't think it's gonna be. It, to be fair, it's either one of these things. It's either gonna be zero zero, nil nil, or two one to Anything. Italy or to England. But like I say, I think we're doing all right. I don't think we haven't played the best. But that's why I think anyway. Any of the, yeah, let me say that, yeah. It's just time I'm not faving. <laughs> no, I just don't, just do it responsibly. But yeah, um, so moving forward then, with us, what are we doing? I'm so, you know, Tyler helped us with that CV and get, yeah, yeah, we yeah, might yeah. be getting a job. <laughs> and then once we get a lot of money, we can get a savings account, we can go out, we can keep working on the set, have pies, you know, um, get better clothes, whatever you want to do, yeah. work on yourself and all that, so. That's what I'll be doing. I mean, I think we all be doing that. Yeah. Because, you know, when a breakup happens in a relationship, the man normally goes to the gym. The man yeah. normally yeah, yeah, improves yeah, yeah. himself. But then you see the girl already in a relationship. Fuck it. Uh. Coward. Coward. Yeah. It I is think. coward to do that. You are a coward. Yeah. No, it's true, though. It is a coward thing to do. Yeah. When you never, if it was a, not a serious one, whatever. It's Not shit if another woman gets in a relationship when you just broke up with yeah. the other person. It yeah. is the worst. I, I I can't imagine it, but I can also feel it's it. Like you meant different to them, but it's like, at the same time, if it weren't serious, fair enough, but like I say, it depends what you say, innit? But next time, for me, just oh, advice, keep a guard up, don't believe everything you say. The microphone, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Um, but, yeah. but yeah, the man usually does go to the gym a lot and like work on himself. You know, mm. and that's what you should do. You shouldn't be looking out for a relationship. You should, right. you should just be doing your own thing. Yeah, hit, hit on the girl sometimes, but make it more natural. You yeah. know, it's fun then. But like I said, I don't regret any of my past, past relationships. Um, yeah. Don't always ask them all the time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, let them come up to you for once. Yeah. But like I said, I think there should not be no regret in relationships. I see people saying, oh, I regret for three years relationship. Like, you do have, you made so many memories, share yeah, with those moments. Yeah, I hate moments. the mentality when they break all of that for nothing. It's yeah, like I used to have a mentality. Now I'm looking at it, it's like, you know, I'm glad I made these memories with that person, with that yeah. person. I can share with them and look back, back at it. Yeah. Now we move forward, you know. I'm uh, glad. Let's change the topic. Um, more fun side of things. Sex. <laughs> Sex. Um, How is it? It's overrated, Adam. Blowjobs are. Fucking hell. I think blowjobs are overrated. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, <laughs> I mean, they, uh, I don't know. I think they're a bit overrated. Can't <laughs> but you, you can. Mm, yeah, but, um, yeah, kind of. But anyway, yeah, I'm not really that sexual active anyway. <laughs> My next relationship, I probably would be. But you know what I'm saying, right? Yeah, no, it's whatever in it. It's whatever in it. Anything else? And think about the world. Anything. Politics. Our favorite holiday. Our dream holiday. You go first. Uh, Probably going away somewhere hot with loads of people that I know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where, where, though? That's a lot of places. <laughs> I was in Hawaii, mate. <laughs> yeah, Hawaii, yeah, Hawaii. I love to go to Hawaii. Yeah, yeah man. Is that, that's my favourite one, Hawaii. What about you? Same. If not Spain or Australia, but Australia spider, so I might not serve it. Also, we should do a podcast whilst we're drunk at one point. Yeah, we have, one, we have time, to. one time, one time. Whilst we're drinking, I'm not Saturday. <laughs> yeah, at one point we will have to. For sure. Unless we have a couple of cans before. Before Saturday? Yeah. Because the game starts at 7. So if you're here, when does it start? I think it does start. Kick-off so. will be about... Kick-off's at quarter, 
plot to eight. So we so can we, have we can like if podcast on Saturday, drink a big, a bit drunk, get, and like, watch it. Start drinking releases. for now. We're here. Have like three, four cans. Go to dad's. Maybe we'll. See. We don't know yet. We'll see. It'll be good though. It does depend. Uh, but but if not, we definitely will get it. Going to do it. Yeah. But we don't know when, but in future. Let's have a look at this. Wait, let's have a look. Wait, wait. We should put a flash warning for anyone. Sorry, guys, yeah, this is a bit flashy, flashy. Let's have a look. What was the biggest um, regret? No, what's the big? What's the most embarrassing thing you've ever done? There you go. I'm trying to come my. Probably smack somebody around the face that didn't deserve it all the time. So he's looking at me. <laughs> <laughs> Mine yeah. is probably like um, when you wave at someone and they don't actually wave at you. I did oh that. I did that the other God. day. You did that yesterday. You know why? I had my earphones in and he was—he looks like he was looking at me. I was like, "Hey," but he was acting because usually when he walks past me, he says, "Hey," up to me. So when I saw him speaking to someone, I was like, "Oh shit, no man!" I was that like was that. So embarrassing. Yeah, it was. Yeah. Don't even know what to do. You hope no one doesn't see it. Cause if no one didn't see it. it, you're fine. But I mean. You're fine, but you're still embarrassing the old mind, isn't it? Yeah. It's a bit, you know. Yeah. About teachers in old school, what was our favourite teachers? We named them, we named them. Mrs. Trussell was like, alright. Oh, your favourite teacher? I was going to say Mrs. Trussell as well, she were alright. Yeah. Bit too big for me. <laughs> <laughs> what? Bit too big. <laughs> I'm not <laughs> saying anything. Um, what do you think about transgender? Okay, okay. I'm going to get it. Let me tell you something about transgender here. Because I know one person, I'm friends with this one person who's friends with. You can't say this. I'm not going to say oh, it. For... Oh, well, I'm not mean. Oh, okay. But I think transgender is complete bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> wait a minute, wait a no, minute. Okay. Wait a minute. To turn down the movie. We're going to get cancelled. Hear me out, hear me this out. This has nothing to do with me. I'm let me. Hear me out. Let me tell you. No, I don't say it's complete bullshit. <laughs> but I disagree with it. Like, hardly. You still have to respect it. Of course. Yeah. But, uh, obviously, I don't go up to it. Hey, what the fuck? It's, no, that's me to be like, couldn't it? But, I think, at the end of the day, com- ignore all this hundred senders bullshit. Yeah. You didn't know there's this thing. If we go to the gym and we try to avoid being fat, apparently that's fat phobic. What the fuck? It's like yeah. seeing a black guy. If you're trying to purposely avoid a black guy, you're being racist, right? Which you are. Yeah. But, that, but it's the same thing. Apparently, to these people, if we try to avoid being fat, that's fat phobic. To the fatties. To the fatties, yeah. What the fuck? That's why I heard. But the fatties have a problem then. Like, fucking lose some weight. See, that's what I mean. They'll, okay, wait they'll a minute. Try to get Unless out. you have something. That's what I mean. In okay. Yeah. That's what I mean. Fat people are <sighs> like. There are people who are cowards. They'll make any excuse. Wait a minute, On, Adam, they'll Adam, blame Adam, the world. Wait a minute, Adam, himself. Adam, wait a minute. You saw you when I start saying about fat people. Because we know other people. Ad- no, 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 I'm not. It. Look, fat people are amazing people. I uh, can't get changed <laughs> theory. Oh Listen, my. hear me out. I am not on about their personality. I'm on about if a fat person says, "Yeah, I know I'm fat." Fair play. You know what the fuck you're doing. Yeah. You know you're fat. Whatever. Just don't complain that yeah. you're fat. That's yeah, what yeah, I'm yeah, all yeah, about. Yeah. I don't care if someone's fat. If they can say, "Yeah, look at me, I'm fat." As fuck, it's whatever. If you can admit it and you know where the fuck you're at in life, you know you're fat. You, you admit it and you, you're aware. It's like respect. I don't have a problem. You. I don't have a problem with fat people, fuck it out. But I get a problem when people tries to avoid um Mike, what's it, Jim is fat? Yeah, like when people say, Oh, why am I fat? Why am I this? Why am I that? It's it changing it then. Change it. Yeah, Simple yeah, as that. Yeah. Change it. It's not that's my point. It's not, not about being fat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jesus Christ, I'm not mean. But yeah, it's yeah. when they it's when it, they so complain can't. about being fat and they don't take no action. Yeah, yeah. That's what I'm on about. If someone says, Yeah, I'm not I'm fat, yeah. I'm on about physical, not the personality. Yeah. That's my point. When they don't take action, but yeah, and yeah. if people don't like what I'm saying, it's the it's what I think is the truth. It's, yeah. it's the realistic truth. Like, if you know, you're fat, you don't want to be fat. God, one of my mates used to be like, oh, I want to be good looking as you, James. I want to do do do. I'm like, fucking do something about do it. Do something about it. That's like, what I mean. That's what I'm on about. Yeah. That's when not I'm just, not fat people. It's just an example of like, if they want to lose weight. Yeah. Or oh, they can't be asked. Yeah. But let's say another person who's like skinny, like yours, and we moan that we want to get bigger, but we're not doing nothing about it. Bro, I'm gonna get sick. I'm like, yeah, no shit. I'm not doing nothing. Obviously. That's stupid for me. You're realistic, isn't it? Yeah, I'll say it to myself too, like, simple as that. Yeah. But you're transgender. What I think about transgender is like. They. At the end of the day, you have a penis or a dick. Penis or a dick? Oh, God. (laughs) 
I meant a penis and a fanny. Uh, yeah. That's the truth. There's only two genders. At the end of the day, I don't give a shit if someone is transgender. I don't give a shit about whatever they want to be. Yes, yeah. I don't give a shit if they say they are a cheater or a crocodile. At the end of the day, it's either this one question. Do you have a penis or do you have a fanny? Simple as that. Because it's simple as that. It's like you either have a dick or a fanny. <laughs> but, uh, That's right. This might be our last podcast on here. <laughs> nah, nah, well, we can do what the fuck we want. It's not being pussies, guys. We yeah, are I just, I just don't want people seeing me the wrong way. Oh, you disagree with fat people. No, nah, we I don't. don't. We're not. It's just when they don't take action when they complain about it. It's like me saying if I'm skinny and I'm not doing nothing about it. Same yes, shit. that's my point. It's yeah, not yeah, about yeah. fat people. It's, it's friend- about when they complain about themselves. Another thing I want to talk about is when they miss your point. Yes. When, when you make a good point, but they like. They understand. They don't understand what you're actually trying to say. Yeah. They could easily be like right now, like, oh, you, you you hating on fat people? We're well, no, not. It's just if it, for anyone says like, I want to do this, I want to do that, but they're not doing it. I'm instantly gonna be like, what the fuck is doing then? That's the problem. Not that's the point. Not you're fat. I don't like you. I don't respect you. I don't fuck. I respect everyone. It's just if they say, oh yeah, I'm fat. I don't know what to do about it. I can't be asked to go to the gym though. Well, stop complaining you're fat. Yeah, shut up. Oh, people need to stop complaining the fat all the time. Yeah, stop complaining <laughs> that you're skinny. Stop. No, do something about it. You know. Just that's what I'm, that's Get exercise point. and stuff like that. Simple as that. That's my point. Not, I don't respect fat people. All right, skinny people. Are, you know, that's not my point. If you think that's my point, it's still a problem. But I'm not saying no. these people are going to come out. But I'm, I'm fucking putting my guard up. You know what people are like nowadays mm. with snowflakes. So, yeah. Everybody's, everybody will have comments about it eventually. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. But um, anything else you want to talk about? You want to talk about something? Think about anything. I don't know. It's a bit anything? About. You can talk about, think about anything. I don't know. I got any topics. Good, isn't <laughs> Great episode. <laughs> um, we just fucking ran to the bar. We just ran this podcast. We just gotta like <laughs> run and then not talk about something. Oh, good things. <sighs> good things. Race, <laughs> races, races. No, it's not. It's not a good thing. But let's talk about racism and how it's fucked up. Oh yeah. Okay, you go first. James. Oh, someone. Sorry, you wanna go? What do you think about racism? Uh, well, racism is just how it is. It depends yeah. on yeah. how you are. Yeah, I, it's. I can't believe people are still racist to this day. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's how they've been raised. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's how they've been raised. If, if you're if, they, if you surround yourself with black, pe- white people, white people, and like your parents drilled tw- into you that black people are mean, and you, you you get that in your head since you were free, you're gonna grow up like that. Yeah. And that's why I feel bad for people who are racist because you've been you've been raised this wrong. Is, Raises yeah. to them as well. Yeah, you've been raised wrong. It's like simple as that. Yeah. You, you have to open your eyes. And you need your own mindset. You need yeah. your own opinion. You need you. You need to speak up for what you think, not what someone has told you. Yeah, we're all equal, aren't we? So. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Everybody's equal. Just respect one another. Everybody's yeah. equal in different ways, but at the end of the day, men are stronger than women. <laughs> <laughs> you say it's a bad racism <laughs> to fucking <laughs> black. Um, no, let me tell you. Let me tell you. Go ahead. Men now. is more physically stronger scientifically yeah so men are when you with a wife and man a man if a man says can you make me some breakfast you are expected to do it because you know why because let me tell you why if a man ask a woman can you make me breakfast if they have nothing to do a woman they have nothing and they say no they like they're the attitude that like, no i'm not making you breakfast you do it for yourself you say okay then so let's say if we're sleeping upstairs and someone breaks in our house who's the first person to go downstairs me the man. Yeah. That is the yeah. truth. The man will go downstairs. Yeah, so if I expect you, if I say to you, can you make me some breakfast, breakfast, please? If there's no reasonable answer and you can say no, fuck you then. Yeah. It's like, nah, that's how it works. Because yeah. we all know if a burglar breaks in the house, the man is the first, the, the first person to go downstairs. Yeah. That is the truth. Yeah. That is the truth. Yeah. So these double standards should be a thing. Yeah. It's, it's the roles. There are still roles in men and there are still roles in women. Right guys, I don't know what happened in the podcast case, right? The podcast did cut away, I don't know how far we got into it. We were talking about um, people and women roles. I don't know if you guys heard that because it just cut away. But we're going to end the podcast now. Like I say, you like and subscribe, Charlie's YouTube channel is called... Charlie Pippen and Friends 2021. Yeah, so check that out and um, yeah, we'll we'll keep you guys updated. And yeah, thanks for watching and yeah, we're going to say something change. I'm still single, so stay this, come on. But yeah, guys, we'll see you guys in the next video. Peace! Oh, bloody hell. We're getting cancelled. <laughs>